Hey Aries, I hope you're doing well. This is going to be a general reading for today, September the 16th to Thursday, September the 19th. Any information you need, you can find it in the description box down below, Aries. I do have a same day special going on right now. It's 22-22. It's three questions. You get this within 24 hours. This does close tomorrow, uh, September the 17th at 7 p.m. Eastern Time. Details are down below, okay? So we're going to go ahead and begin here, see what we got for you. Alright, this is for Aries. We have for Aries. Wow, we're starting off with the Five of Pentacles. Okay, some of you could be a little bit nervous today or feeling kind of left out of the loop about something. Um, you could be feeling nervous, like maybe a bill has snuck up on you or something of that nature here. We have the Ace of Wands showing up for tomorrow's energy. So it looks like there is something that turns around here or there is something that's going to be okay. Some of you may end up like reaching out to someone here. Um, now, it doesn't have to be for some sort of like critical help, but I do feel like you could be like asking someone uh, for advice about something or, you know, some sort of explanation or truth. Wednesday's energy, you have the Four of Cups, okay? Somebody here might have their moon in Cancer. You could be feeling ignored or avoided. Uh, you know, again, just like weird energy here. Let's see what we got for Thursday. Three of Pentacles, okay? Someone working with you again, collaborating with you. You know what, Aries? For some of you, if this is like a love situation, I feel like there could be somebody who's very hot and cold, like, oh yeah, you know, I'm gonna, you know, uh, get all this together and then I'll be fine and blah 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 and you know somebody could be making you some empty promises or something of that nature here um we'll see what we got going on though some of these things obviously are not going to be related to love for all of you um so some of you this could definitely be work you got two pinnacle cards here we'll see what's happening what's going on with this five of pinnacles for Aries for Monday's energy this is today for Monday's energy Queen of Pentacles showing up here. Very domestic queen. Like, I, again, I feel like for some of you, this may have to do with bills or a commitment of some sort here. Could be a Capricorn who's kind of leaving you out of the loop or ignoring you or not answering a question about something here as well for some. Seven of Swords. Yeah, some of you, I feel like you could be fearful that there's trickery, theft, or deception or something's going to be taken here. Yeah, that's weird energy. You got the star. You know, I really feel like something's going to turn around for you. Some of you could be trying to, like, uh, prepare for the worst so you're kind of believing that the worst might happen just be cautious of that energy here um you know because i feel like there could be something that may be like it may not be ideal you may be right about that but it may not be as bad as you think either okay um now as far as deception and like a friendship or a love situation i can definitely see where that uh where that would be concerning okay with that seven of swords energy here um what's going on with the ace of wands showing up here for tuesday's energy Ace of Swords. Okay, two aces. Some sort of good news on Tuesday here. The Sun. Wow. Yeah, there could be some sort of news that comes in tomorrow that makes you very happy. The Sun is the happiest card in the deck. It's high vibrations. It's joy. It's new beginnings. Okay, so yeah, it could be some sort of good news or clarity. Like I said, I think for a lot of you, whatever you're afraid of over here today that may be like taken or not worked out or something like that here, um, I do feel like it's worked out. I feel like there's going to be some sort of clarity on that. Yeah, you have the Two of Pentacles because something's kind of been um, imbalanced. Like for some of you, if there is something that has like maybe cleared out of your account, for example, Aries, and you're like, oh my gosh, I forgot all about that so how is this going to work like with this bill coming out you know some of you could be in that kind of energy and you know no judgment at all like a lot of us are in that energy you know but you know when it comes to uh like I, i've seen this this type of stuff come up a lot lately um like it's just kind of progressively gotten worse over the last few years but you know when it comes to um that energy the five of pentacles the seven of swords the two of pentacles like there's just something that's like had an imbalance here and you know but I do see mostly with the two of pentacles that something's able to get moved around for you okay so this could be like a payment date or something of that nature for example Aries that could be the good news that's here like a payment date may be able to be moved around for you or something of that nature some of you it could be that there's been some sort of rockiness in a situation with a person and they're explaining something to you you know um mm. some of you there could be a person who owes you money that may be the case here as well for some and, you know, like when, when it comes to this energy here, I, I feel like this is something that you genuinely did out of the kindness of your heart here, Aries. But I do feel like there could be a person um, who's feeling like you don't you don't need that money back. You know, there's, there's something like that going on here. Like they may be a little bit worse off, you know. And like I said, it's just, you know, it's the economy. Like I'd be surprised if, if there were people that were in the best possible place they could be in on a financial level, you know. Um, other than those, you know, up top there. But... 
when it, when it comes to this energy, though, with the Seven of Swords and the Five of Pentacles, um, some of you may feel like you've been uh, taken from here because this person's not wanting to give something back to you that they, you know, agreed to give back to you. So that may show up as a problem here. And, you know, I think that you may end up having to be, like, direct uh, about it here, unfortunately. Like, you may have to remind this person multiple times that, that could be something that happens. And, again, I feel like a lot of us have been there as well, you know. Um yeah, Aries. I mean, it's just a, it's, it's a tough position here that I feel someone has put you in, unfortunately. Um, which again, like a lot of us have been in that situation where it's like we have to confront something head on if we want to get it fixed. And that's typically how this has to go in situations like this. I had a situation like this. Um, it's been a while ago, but yeah, it's like it, just being given the runaround, you know, and um, when you're owed something, you know, and so it's like when you're in that kind of situation, you may be the kind of person who's like, oh, I want to give this back right away. Like I want that, like it's in the back of your mind, you know, to remember to do that, to show your gratitude. But then when you've done this for a person, they're kind of like ducking and dodging you. And it's like, you know, I think for some of you, that could be the case here as well. You get the four of pentacles, or I'm sorry, the four of cups energy showing up for Wednesday. Okay. But Tuesday, it does look like some good news, something balancing out. So uh, I do like that that was showing up there. What's going on with the four of cups for Wednesday's energy. The tower. Okay. I, I feel like excuses. You're being given excuses. Again, whether this is in a situation where you've done a favor for someone, they owe you something. Okay. Or it's like, maybe this is a love situation for some of you where it's like, I feel like somebody's giving you a lot of excuses and you're not buying it. You know, it's like dog ate my homework type of energy here. Um, let me see what else we got here for that. Page of Cups. Some of you, like a cell tower may be down near you as well. Um, something like that may happen on Wednesday. I feel like somebody could be trying to get a hold of you or you're trying to get a hold of somebody. I feel like there could genuinely be something with like a cell tower. But, you know, I do feel like there could be a person here as well who is um, making some empty promises to you. You have the Wheel of Fortune showing up, fixed energy, Aquarius, Taurus, Scorpio, Leo. Um, it's like the cycle just kind of continues, you know. It's like it's different if there's one thing that happens, you know. Um, but it, it seems like there could be somebody consistently having an issue with showing up you know, with showing up, with following through, and it's like, we're, we're too grown for that, you know, and I think that's the energy that you're in here on Wednesday, it's like, we're too grown for this, I'm gonna have to close this cycle, whether it's a legitimate, um, you know, reason, or it's an excuse, it's just becoming too much, you know, it's becoming too often, right, so some of you, that could be the case here, but I do see a lot of, like, um, in and out communication, you know, so that could be that like maybe you're calling somewhere, the call's getting dropped, you're having to call back, or it's possible that you're playing phone tag with a person here in regards to a tower. You know, this could be a professional of some sort in regards to like a problem, a mess up, you know, maybe you need a refund on something, or maybe you um maybe you need to like reschedule an appointment or something, right? Uh I do feel that there's something that goes on here where there's some sort of back and forth like uh type of communication here like phone tag or something like that. You do have the Three of Pentacles showing up for Thursday's energy. I feel like there could be a boss or an authority figure kind of leaving you out of the loop about something here as well, Aries, between the 16th and the 19th. So I don't know what's what's going on with that. Um, you could feel like you're being tricked or deceived or something of that nature here, but I do feel like there could be like a person who you've maybe had problems with, and that's why there could be some sort of like, um, you know, separation. It may not have anything to do with you specifically, but just uh, you and this person and your issue, you know? Three of Pentacles energy. I feel like something's going to be worked through. You know, if you've had a problem with a person at work, Aries, I feel like you may have an authority figure on Thursday, like try to hash something out between the two of you, like a mediator type situation. Um, Let's see what else we have here. You could finish some sort of project up on Tuesday, or I'm sorry, on Thursday as well. Yeah, I feel like you're able to wash your hands of something, though, on, on this day. I feel like you're able to wash your hands of something. You get some sort of news. If you felt like there was some sort of deception in the workplace, I feel like you're going to get some sort of clarity on that on Thursday. Something's going to be cleared up, okay? Aries, I feel like there could be a lot of worry around you uh, between now and Thursday, but I really don't feel like it's necessary. I know there's, like, some sort of back-and-forth energy here, or there may be a waiting game. Just because you're waiting doesn't mean it's going to be, like, some bad news, so just keep that in mind. I do see some sort of good news tomorrow. I mean, you got that sun card. I I feel like there's something here that's going to balance out. Like it's been unstable, but somebody's going to move some things around or help you out. Or there's going to be some sort of agreement that takes place here that I feel allows something to stable out for you. You have King of Pentacles and the Queen of Cups energy. I feel like somebody's 
like feeling what you're saying here. I feel like they're hearing that you, they're seeing you and they're working on something. This does not have to be a love situation, although it could be because for a lot of you, I feel like whatever love situation that is, it's kind of going round and round where somebody is just like changing for a few days or for, or for a few weeks and then it's back to the same old stuff, you know? So there is that kind of uh, energy, that possibility here as well. Could be a Taurus, could be a Cancerian. Um, this, this got way longer than my usual reads. Um, but yeah, that's what I am seeing here for you, Aries. I hope that this was helpful. Don't forget that I do have uh, personals open right now. It's a same day read. It's three questions. It's 2222. You get it within 24 hours, okay? Details are down below. Uh, that does close tomorrow, though, Tuesday, um, September 17th at 7 p.m. Eastern Time. Everything's down there, but if this is where we part, thank you for being here. I really appreciate you, and hopefully I'll see you next time. Bye.